Uh, I'm kind of excited. I got uh, finally got around to getting a metal blade for my bandsaw. So instead of uh, hand cutting all my bottle openers, I'm going to see. I'm going to try to do it with this uh, bandsaw. See how much faster it goes. Probably should have done this a long time ago, but oh well, let me learn. Cuts like butter. Yep, should have done that a long time ago. <laughs> Definitely saved me a lot of heartache and time. I'm gonna try to pray that sucker out here. There we go. Yep, and then what I'll do is I'll um, I'm gonna cut that a little bit more. do is I'll come back in with a file and finish that off so that makes life a lot easier on me uh, let me see where my bottle cap is yep perfect you see right there it's got a good grab on it got some good leverage nice all right well let me clean this up and go from there I also got this polishing wheel. You can buy it at a hardware store. It comes with some extra pads and some polishing compound here. Uh, what I'm going to do first, though, is I'm going to try out just hand polishing it with some rubbing compound, uh, car rubbing compound. And here's what it looks like before. Here's where I just started trying to shine it up so I'm gonna shine it up by hand see what it looks like and then I'll hit it with the wheel and see what kind of difference it makes well it definitely makes a good difference between here's the before kind of dull and then here's the after it is more shiny but uh, it's too much work so uh, and it doesn't get these these spots here off so I'm going to do it with the, on the wheel. And uh, these little scratch marks here, I'll, I'll get those with the file. And I've got a Dremel that'll get that off. Around here in this groove here, it's going to be a little... Uh, I might be able to get that with the polishing wheel. We'll see. Not too shabby, and a lot quicker and a little less effort too. So uh, you can see what the polishing wheel did there, and it did it. It's doing a pretty good job taking these little spots off. So uh, let me get the rest of it polished up and take a look at it. All right, <laughs> this is after. This is before. So, yeah, I think I like the, uh, the polishing setup. Definitely cuts down my time making one of these and polishing them up. So, I still got some Dremel work to do around the mouth of this thing. Clean it up a little bit, but I'm happy with it. Even shine, even shine the bottom. So, woohoo! Of course, now... I went through my stash and I, I'm slowly running out of these, so if anybody has any of these they want to donate or, I don't know, trade for some bottle openers, let me know.